Oh no. It's back. It's starting again. It never stops. It just keeps burning. It won't let me go. <laughs> I think we got something in common. We know what love is. We know what it is to love a woman. You do anything for her. Am I right? And something else we got. We know what it is to lose it. Lose it all. To not be in control. Heart. 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 I can't even remember what I was in here for. Beating up some guy, whatever. I got screwed by the system. Fuck them. They fucked my life. They're as responsible for my old lady's dying as I am. Nobody wants the whole story. Just lock them up, throw away the key. See you next life. Why won't it stop? Just wanted to keep her safe. I couldn't protect her while I was on the inside. They beat me up. I lay awake at night thinking of what would happen to her. Any guy like me, any guy really loved his old lady would have done the same thing. I just wanna die! God, so I couldn't take it anymore. So on that day, she came over for a conjugal and we fucked. I screwed her like I never had before. It was smooth, warm, rough, and sweet. The best lay of our lives. Stop it! Stop me! And then, she was laying there after. She looked so beautiful with a sheen of sweat on her. And I did it. Cut her. Every last inch of her. All over. I cut her. Scalding! I can't fucking take it! Thank... You... Horus. Many inmates break once inside Abbott, but none have snapped more extremely than Horus Gage, who, the tale goes, became convinced his wife wasn't safe without his protection, and sliced her to ribbons during a conjugal visit. He ended up in the mercy chair, electrocuted by Abbott's then-executioner Hermes Haight. For years, inmates have said he haunts Abbott, and I believe I saw him ten minutes ago. I surely wish I had not. Just you and me. We will meet again later. I look forward to it.
Daddy, I love you, Daddy. You wouldn't hurt us. Dad, I'm over here. You're not so bad, I guess. I just wish you'd always been there, you know? T! Oh, something broke in you in that group home, T. And I didn't have enough time to fix it. There's beauty in you. I could always see it. Stay strong for me, okay? It's not safe out here, Harley! It's not safe! Don't try to stop me! I'm gonna cleanse the motherfucking Earth! You're gonna get us both killed, you psycho! Suck my cock, you rodent fucks! What the hell are you thinking? Get, it, you get back in the tower! Maggots! Harley, get back! You're lucky Harley's obsessed with those rats. He didn't used to like inmates much, neither. I'm going back out there to kill the rest of those motherfucking bastards. No, Harley, no! Stay here! We're gonna stay inside this tower until it's safe outside. 
It's gonna be safe again, right? It's the motherfucking apocalypse. Harley, it's safe now. It's safe. Look, I inmate, I'm sorry he's like this. Goddamn he just needs some time. To take all alone. those fuckers out. Now it's safe. Look, inmate, I'm sorry he's like this. I wish I just need some goddamn Take all those fuckers out.
Getting outside, but I don't need to tell you that. You know there is no real escape. in the cell. Kaboom! Y'all feel me?
betraying the United States Army. You are hereby sentenced to death by firing squad. Jesus, save me. Enough. Weapons to the ready. Take aim. Fire. The bluff. On the south side of the island near Fort Malison, there is a bluff which appears to have been forgotten since the 1940s. Along the ocean side of the bluff are three wood posts riddled with bullets to which dead bodies are still attached. This seems to be the site of the little-known 1944 execution of three American soldiers, executed on suspicion of treason. No actual evidence of wrongdoing was ever found. Y'all won't get me! <laughs> Fucking pigs!
Your grave, motherfucker! Couldn't save Cory and Malcolm from the fire. They're with us now. Word is bond. I'll fuck you up. World War II Fort. Built in 1942, Fort Mallison served as both coastal defense facility and POW camp. The fort had some 250 men and held approximately 1,000 prisoners. The fort's most notorious story is of its colonel, who executed three of his men for treason because a German airplane crashed on the island. A subsequent court martial found no evidence to justify these executions, and the colonel ended up taking his own life.
him back! Get me out of here! Fucker tried to kill you. He was confused. Steve here to rot. Gotta help him. He'll die in here. Shit! I think I hear something coming. You gotta blow this wall without killing me. Thanks, man. I would have gotten out of there myself, but you just sped the shit up. Hey, sorry about trying to blow you up back there, but I thought you were a hack. Look, I've been in Abbott too long, damn it. Look, I ain't going back, you feel me? Come on, we gotta get to the lighthouse. Look, it's right up here. Come on. What's the hold up? You with me, dog? The lighthouse has a basement. It's like a bunker. Look, we can hold up there and wait until the dope wears off and these hacks are out of ammo. Look, it's tight up in these caverns, but I know all the shortcuts. What's the hold up?
thanks for helping me out back there, but I would have made it on my own, so don't act like you saved my life or nothing. I'm gonna make it through this bad trip. I don't need nobody. Make me a believer! Represent, motherfucker! With me, dog. How much longer do we have to wait in here? As long as it takes. Are those girls gonna find us? I don't think so. Are we gonna have enough air? There's plenty the of ticking. ventilation. Calm down. What about food? I don't know. I think we should. What's the hold Rhett, up? Yeah. When we run out of food, you're gonna be the first one we eat. Are you with me, dog? It's right up here. Come on. We're almost to the lighthouse. Come on. It's hard enough being a black man in this country. You be a brother who wants to make something of himself, got himself some real bread, and they liable to lock you up. Just look at me. Cops fucking me my whole life. Sweet! This is it! We're set now. It's like a vault in here. Nothing can get in. Nothing? You say something? Yes. What was that? I think the dough's coming back. Breathe deep. <coughs> that smell! <coughs> what in the fuck's going on? That always feels good. He needed to go. He wasn't interesting enough. Not like you. You understand how it feels. He needed someone professional to pull the switch. A lot of eager sadists applied, but I was the only one who took the work seriously. So seriously I wanted to taste the gas myself. That's what Conant does, it brings out the killer inside. It's the perfect place for you and me. There's a difference between those that feel safest in the light and those that feel safest in the dark. Which are you, Torque? 